In today's video, we're going to be looking at the French Bulldog and how adaptable they are. Welcome back to the French Bulldog channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Mimi. I'm a registered canine leader here at FenrirCanineLeaders.com. This channel is dedicated to helping you learn everything you could possibly want to know about the French Bulldog, then how to become high-level canine leaders that can raise perfect French Bulldogs. So if you're a lifelong French Bulldog lover, you're thinking about getting one, or you're just starting your journey with your new French Bulldog pup, then this channel is for you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a future French Bulldog video. So then let's get into today's video where we will be looking at the French Bulldog and how adaptable they are. The Frenchie is a companion dog through and through. This little dog much prefers the company of people to being isolated and that is thanks to humans breeding them over the past few centuries. They've been bred to keep people of all walks of life company in day-to-day -day life and that has been one of their best qualities even today. Their affection is arguably what has made them one of the most popular breeds still in the modern world. With all this in mind, they are actually one of the more adaptable breeds. They are at their happiest when they're with people. Their loyalty allows you flexibility if you should want to move to a new house, or even if you wanted to take them on a road trip. One of the key things to remember though with a French Bulldog is that they are prone to separation anxiety. The centuries of evolution to become the perfect companion has left them with an inability to cope well by themselves. Whilst they're happy to follow their humans wherever they may go, you do well to make sure that they can always have a certain level of your time and attention. Yes, they can be happy to move house and trail across country with you, but they won't tolerate less time with you. Separation anxiety can come in many forms, but destruction is the main one. They have a mischievous side, and that will quickly become apparent if they're left too long to their own devices. If you have to leave them for an hour or two, Kongs filled with their favourite treat can engage their mind for long enough for you to escape teeth marks on table legs. But a whole day alone will make for a miserable Frenchie, so always try to keep them in friendly company if you can. This little dog is a perfect companion and with that comes a relaxed personality. So that means that they aren't what you would call highly strung in the same way as a Spaniel is. A highly strung dog will be extremely fussy for attention and engagement, much like puppies or toddlers, and even though Frenchies can become fussy if they feel like they're missing out on something interesting, but they are just as happy to keep a close eye on things from a comfy spot on the sofa. They haven't got high working drive or a mind that needs engaging 24-7, so they won't need as much work to stay mentally stimulated. By not being highly strung, they are able to adapt to different environments and different schedules. Another one of the most attractive qualities of a Frenchie is that they are a small and compact dog, meaning they can be right at home just about anywhere. They will be just as happy in a flat if provided the right amount of outside exercise, as well as a sprawling mansion to strut around all day. They can be happy in a high rise in New York or even parading around a stately home in England. They have made their way into all walks of life and have done for centuries. One thing to note about their physicality though is that they don't particularly do well in extreme temperatures. They won't cope well in the heat, as due to their flat muzzle. They're incapable of efficiently cooling themselves by panting, which risks heat stroke. And if you happen to live somewhere where snow can fall in the winter months, booties and a coat can be enough if you wanted to walk them around the block. But they won't enjoy a permanently cold environment. So let's recap on the Frenchie's adaptability. These are loyal, companion dogs, happiest with their humans. This means they'll be happy to move homes, as their home tends to be wherever their favourite people are. They aren't highly strung, but they can be fussy when they think they may be missing out on something exciting. And their compact size makes them perfect for just about any home, from a flat to a mansion. However, extreme weathers are not suitable environment for a Frenchie. They do best in moderate temperatures. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If so, make sure you hit that like button. Get involved down in the comment section below. And don't forget that if you are new here, to make sure you subscribe. We have two dedicated French Bulldog videos coming here every week. So I can't wait to talk to you again on the next episode of the French Bulldog channel.